Hey everyone. So uh, yeah, another day, another nice cold, cool day. It's a little bit misty and rainy. And uh, today I want to talk about the raccoons. You know those cute raccoons that I sent you all the videos previously at the other house? Well, at this house they're a little bit of a pain because they get into the garbage. We actually thought there wasn't going to be that many wild animals around because there's not a lot of bush around us at the moment. I mean, we are in town. It's like houses everywhere. And um, so in the previous house, we always kept the garbage bins in the garage because we had a garage. At this house, there's no garage. There's just like a carport. So, I mean, we don't want to keep the garbage bin in the house because it starts smelling because they only collect garbage every two weeks, you know, and it's not always great. I mean, we chuck the other stuff in the green bin, which has a lock, but our garbage bin doesn't have a lock. So uh, we left it outside because we saw the neighbors' garbage bins are standing outside against the fence. And, you know, it seems like the thing to do. Until I got outside today and the garbage bin this morning is all like tipped over. All the bags are out there and ripped apart and <laughs> it rained. So you've got all these little wet raccoon footsteps around i must have just missed the little bastard but anyway so now we got to figure out a new plan with the garbage because we got a raccoon around that um loves our garbage little bastard they're so cute though i must say they are really cute but they're very naughty and they're very clever which is um which is a funny thing i mean i remember that at the previous house how they would push their little hands in and take stuff it's um it's funny Anyway, thought I'd update you. I have more problems with wildlife here in West Vancouver than I have had in Joburg in all my life. <laughs> all right, folks, have a good one.